All right, guys, we're trying to redeem ourselves with the use toss. We're going to start making some big plays here. I, I want to try to perfect my gameplay with use toss. Obviously, we're going to return this hand. We have too many straw swords. Mulligan. Okay, this is much better. We get a Kazuki. We get a Okiku. There is no way for us to get our Basil. We don't have a searcher for him. So turn three, we might play the killers. We'll see. We're not going to play Kazuki. I'm going to attack. Then we'll Okiku. Then next turn we're going to uh, Kazuki. Momonosuke. There's really nothing we can search with this Kazuki besides our Aizo, maybe an Okiku. But there, that's it. Maybe another Kazuki. Okay, so he does take that damage, which is am amazing. We could activate Kazuki into... No, I, I would rather have Okiko on the field. And turn. I could have played the uh, Kazuki ability into the killer, but I want to wanna have Okiko. Now, when Okiko attacks, we can play the killers to protect her. And we can activate uh, Kazuki as well. So he's attacking me for 6k. I'll take this one. I actually want to see my hand. No trigger effects. So we do get a 5 cost here, but we're not going to play him. Oh, wow. The killer is going to activate Okiku really well. Alright, let's start with this. Nothing. No way, no county. Damn, we only have an Okiku. See, the Kazuki doesn't really search really well. Alright, so here's my options. I can Okiku into this. Alright, I think we're going to kill her here. And then we protect our Okiku with our, our lives. So here I think he blocks. Then we're going to kill her. That's fine with me. I'll just kill her here. Could also play this. I want to kill this, right? This will be easy to protect. This might not be easy to protect. This is easy to protect. I have a lot of counter. We'll, we'll protect it. Okay, let's just kill this. Okay, end turn. Okay, yeah. That, I think that's the best play there to kill that. Um, he's already a 6 dong. He hasn't activated his ability once. His hand is smaller than mine. He doesn't. He only has one attack this turn. He could king, though. Kill my Okiku. Let's see what he does. In two turns, he's going to be able to, to get out a, a Kaido. Let's see what he does. So 6k is going to attack. I'm going to protect this easily. Unless it hits Kozuki, then I'll let it go through. So we're going to protect this. I think he should give more down here. I think he should really establish a, a big attack here. At least, at least make it a 7k. Oh, he's just going to attack Kozuki. I'll take him. Oh, so I think he did that just to get the Dawn. So now he's 9 Dawn next turn. Damn, it's big. It's very big. Kaido can come down next turn. Draw card. Draw Dawn. Okay, we have options here. Give Okiku two attacks. Give a killer an attack. Play X Drake. Is that all we do? Start with Okiku here and set, set this guy sideways. I think we're going to X Drake this guy.
I really don't believe this is the wrong play. He counters here. Kuzuki doesn't give me nothing, to be honest. Unless it's an Izu. Oh, he actually b blocks. This is amazing value when we kill this. With the X-Trick. The thing is, he can counter me with a Kaido 9-drop. Kill everything on my field. But to be honest, Kaido 9-drop is a little late. We just punch into his face. Let's deploy this. Kill this. He actually plays a Pacifista though. It's huge. That's actually huge. Deploy this and turn. That's actually huge. Kuma's so good. Kuma brings so much value. Kaido dumps. Kills this. Attacks it to this. He's going to clear my field here. I think that be might be a little too late though. Let's see. I might be able to kill him. Okay, I can block, but he's going to attack with Kaido. Into the Okiku. I can't keep blocking. I'll block one, I'll block the other, but he's going to attack me with Kaido. I want to actually take some life. Maybe there's something in there that can help me draw. Nothing. Absolutely nothing in there. Alright, this could be close. Let me see here. So 7k would be 4 dawn. Then I would put 2 dawn here. I don't know. I'm kind of scared, guys. Let's just assume he has no more 2Ks. Fudge. Okay, this is a little scary. We want to drop an Okiku down. But I also want to attack with the killers. So 3 Dawn. On killer. 2 Dawn underneath Eustace. Re-attack. It just doesn't add up. I have to give this guy 7k and this guy 7k. That's the only way. It doesn't add up. If he protects this, he wins this. He survives this turn. If he doesn't protect this, I have potential to end game. Damn, he protects it big. Do we just Okiku into killer here? I think we just Okiku into a killer. Give me one second, let me attack. Cool. Cool, I don't think he can answer this. Maybe he can king us, but if he kings us, then we win next turn. He has no way to stop my next attack. I think we win. Okay, he has a blocker, but we can Okiku it. He needs to deal with Okiku. This is, this is his biggest problem right now is Okiku. Let's see how he deals with Okiku. Whatever he KOs, if he has one down underneath, he's going to get a down. Whatever he KOs, so he can KO with the Pacifista, the killer, or attacks into this and I block it. Whatever happens. If he has another blocker, he might be able to survive next turn. If he doesn't, it's going to be tough with Okiko on the field. She has full control of this blocker. I'm also going to hope to draw a straw sword, so we're going to try not to protect anything. So he attacks without the dawn, so this is a free kill. We don't lose anything. 
He doesn't gain a dawn. He plays on Higashima. Yeah, just that's it. Final turn is what he did there. I'll take the attack. Basil's a little too late. Okiku's on the field. Full control right now. We win game. I think he leaves. <laughs> I think he just leaves the game. We have a Kazuki to let us draw an Izu. We have a Kiku to control this, and we have a Killer to stop any attacks next turn. Point is just kind of sad. He won't give us this turn, but the, the, I mean, I think this is game over. Uh, attack with Okiku 7k. Here, rest him. I doubt she can do anything. Onigashima just came out too late. I don't even know why you play Onigashima in this deck. It's almost consistent you get your draws or your extra dawns. All right, there game. Good game, guys. Um, Kaido is actually really scary. It's just, I think we just were, we did really good trying to control the game. That's really about it. But yeah, guys, um, good game. That was a really good game. We did really good. Yep.